So, welcome everyone to uh, the preseason match of WCA versus Bruce Red Raiders. We have B Ben versus the first player from the Red Raiders, Tyler. Um, all of them are going to be named Tyler, but there will be five of them going. We have Wolf versus Rob. So we have. It looks like we have Rob on a early lead here against Tyler as he takes the center of the stage and takes one stock from Bruce. We have B Ben looking to defend and hopefully take back the center of that stage the center of the stage and having control of it is key to these matches ooh hard hit to be Ben Deflected back to Tyler. And again, B Ben is trying to gain that center of the stage again to gain control. We have a shielding, we have a grab. Is this it for Tyler? Nope, not quite yet. We have a dash attack. And that's another stock taken from Tyler. So we have WCA three stocks left to one stock for Bruce. And it's best of three matches for 1v1s and best to five sets for overall. Ooh, good hit by Bruce there. Can B Ben recover? And that is the last hard hit, and B Ben has won the first match for the 1v1 
Welcome back to round two of Me Ben versus Tyler number one. We have B Ben playing as Wolf and Tyler playing as I do not know that character, unfortunately. So we have Wolf again taking the center of the stage here. So let's see how this goes. Tyler failing to recover with his up B attack there as we have Tyler trying to draw B Ben to the edge to gain control that center. We have B Ben who has knocked Tyler off the stage vertically after gaining control of that edge. And we have one more stock for Bruce to three stocks for B Ben. We have a close tie now here, 90% damage to 126%. Can B Ben pull off that final hard smash? There, there it is. B Ben has taken the last stock from Bruce again and has won two of the three best two out of three. So B Ben has taken this set.
Here we have the BP playing as Mario against Tyler once again. This is the second player from Bruce though. They're all sharing a system. Tyler has failed to execute the up B savior move. So that is one stock taken away from Bruce already. BP3, Bruce 2. Balls being thrown by the BP as he tries to throw Tyler off. Ooh, hard. Smash hit by BP. This is gonna be a close net game here. That is the hit. We have two to two now. First two stock with WCA at two stock. We have a failed up B savior recovering. So now we have one stock for boost to two stock for WCA. BP is in trouble, 135% to 48%. Oh, there is the final smash! Awesome move by BP there. BP takes the first round of his 1v1.
have a battle of the titans here as we have Bowser taking on King DDD. Bowser from WCA, King DDD from Bruce. Both of these opponents are equally matched with their strength and smash attacks. So this should be an interesting battle, folks. We have one stock taken from King DDD already, as we have WCA three stocks. King DDD two. Seems to have been a communication error on my side, so give me a brief moment as we come back in. So we have BP1 versus King DDD, and I heard from the grapevine that we have the BP grabbed King DDD and did a suicide um, stock take. And as a new update, I have a name for this new player versus Tyler, and it will be Quinn versus Lunk.
We have Link versus Byloff, um, based on how the players enter the arena, flip the two stats around, which I can't do that real easily with the streaming software I use. So Lunk is on the right, Quinn is on the left. Lunk takes a big lead in the beginning, 117 damage versus 39 damage currently. Link tries a spin attack and that does not deter Byloff as Lunk keeps the onslaught. Failed recovery with the spin attack by Link there. So we have. Oh, Link's trying to use a bow. Oh, we have a canceling of bows here. We have a good attack with the Master Sword there. Oh, Byloth gets a smash attack out there. That boomerang, kind of going in midair. We have a, a successful spin attack save. Oh, and that is game as Lunk does his down B smash attack.
we have Meta Knight versus Byleth here. Um, Meta Knight being taken on by Quinn again on the left there for the stats, but score on the right on the 1v1 score, I should say. And Lunk on the right with his 1v1 score on the left. That's just a matter of how they decide to enter the arena. We have a failed up B save by Meta Knight there. So that makes WCA 3 stock. Bruce 2 stock. Ooh, good drill attack there by Meta Knight. Hoping to get Byleth onto that uh, edge and take control of the center stage. Ooh, that charged bow attack has got to Meta Knight. WCA, three stock. Bruce, one. Nice parry there by Lunk. You notice there with the shield and then the noise with the parry. We have some tornado attacks that are happening by Meta Knight, hoping to gain a hit on Lunk. Oh, there's a bow, hoping to set Meta Knight off. Smash attack missed there by Lunk. And there it is, folks. There is the final hit. That will take... And WCA takes set three. Overall, WCA has won the preseason match, but we will play all five sets, so stick around.
small change in name here. Uh, Ganondorf, which was um, one of the grandfathers for those that you at know, WCA played last. So now it is actually the real Lunk playing this next round set. Versus again, Tyler. So we have Link versus Three, two, one, go. We have Link versus My Left. And for those of you old school gamers out there, you gotta appreciate the vibes happening right now. We have some Super Mario Brothers 2 overworld theme happening here. Ooh, strong hit there by Lunk, but Link manages to recover. But the air is never a good place for any player to be. And there goes Link after trying a down attack. A down thrust. WCA, three stock, boost two. We have some shield action happening here. And Lunk takes another stock from Tyler, the boost team, um, their fourth player here. So we now have WCA three stock, Tyler one. Link is being brutally attacked by Lunk as he's trying to recover and hopefully we take a stock from Lunk. <coughs> Ooh, Link has managed to survive that final hard smash. Gets a hit off with his boomerang there. Oh, is this it for Link? Nope, he manages to survive another few minutes here. We have four minutes left in this match. Shield action happening here. And I believe there it is. Yes, Lunk has taken the last stock from the boost team to make it three stock, zero stock. Oh, we have Pyro. That's who this is. Some of these new characters, I do not know.
We have King K Rule versus Cloud. I'm again switch the stats around. We have uh, W C A on the right there, and Bruce on the left. King K Rule is a Titan, so we will see how Cloud holds up against King K Rule. One stock has been taken from King K. Rule, leaving WCA three stocks with Bruce at one stock. A uh, two stock. Ooh, another strong hit there by Lunk to move the stock count to three for WCA. One for Bruce. We have that limit bar increasing on Cloud there as Lunk tries increasing it to do a final smash it. Ooh, that limit bar is full. Can King K rule avoid it? Attempt to, oh, look at that parry from King K. Rule. Ooh, failed up B recovery. That makes Lunk two stock. Bruce one stock. Both players trying to gain advantage of that middle of the stage. And there it is. Lunk manages to land the final hit onto King K. Rule. Three, Moving WCA's set score to four. As we move into the final set.
we are moving into the final set. We have. Oh, actually, I don't know who these characters are, unfortunately. Three, two, one, go! There goes the first stock really quickly, only 30 seconds in. Okay, we have Kazuya, which is Zeva Hex. Versus, I'm, I know that's a Pokemon. I don't remember the name though. Ooh, we had a knockout there by Let's have a hex. Let's have a hex has some really strong attacks. So the best way to defeat is to play passive, and that looks like what we have Seth trying to do here. Ooh. Bam attack there. Bruce trying to control that corner there. Oh, and that is a direct hit, making WCA three stock, Bruce one stock. Can Seth remove one stock from Zebahex? We have a good recovery here by Seth. And we have a suicide last stock Kazuya kill. Wins. Leaving Kazuya as the winner.
Oh, we have Kuzia versus Dark Samus. Dark Samus has the same move set as normal Samus, so it should be interesting how Bruce puts these into the use. We have a successful screw attack to recover. Looks like we have Zeva Hex looking to score their first stock. Oh, nice parry there. And there is the first stock. WCA, three stock. Bruce, two. We have some missile work here by Dark Samus trying to recover. Grapple beam attack. Successful grapple beam attack there by Dark Samus. Ooh, Zeva Hex has taken another stock. We have three stock WCA, one stock Bruce. Oh, there was a attempt on a charge beam attack there. We have some warp ball bombs. Oh, that dash attack of Dark Samus is, is really strong. Gotta watch that. And look at that, Bruce has taken a stack from Zeva Hex making the score two to one. Nice, nice dodges there by Bruce. Zeva Hex slowly working the percentage up, and there is the final hit by Zeva Hex. WCA takes the fifth set, making the final score 5 to 0. WCA has won. That brings us to the end of the first match of the season for our WCA Varsity team. This is their preseason match. Come back next week Tuesday for their first week opener. Until then, this is WCA Sports signing off.